So today I'm going to show you how to deposit money into your Charles Schwab account. And you can see we're actually going to be doing this through the website slash browser in real time. So you can follow directly along. Now we're currently here in our account section. This is the homepage when you log into your Charles Schwab account. And what we're going to actually want to do is go to the move money section, which is going to be right over here for us. Now, if we actually just hover, nothing shows up. So we got to make sure we do a click on here and it's going to show a drop down menu. Let me go ahead and clean up the screen here for a second. All right. Now that we have everything cleaned up here on on the screen, we're going to see a bunch of new options that come in for us when it comes to clicking on the move money. Now, typically you can go to transfer and payments, but there's actually a little bit of a faster way by clicking on online transfers. This actually takes us directly to the page we want to go to. All right. So from here, we are now able to set up our transfer and what we're going to want to do is choose the option we want to transfer. Now we're mainly going to be just doing cash for our examples here today. So this is going to be where we're pulling cash from our external bank account directly into Charles Schwab. So this is the option that's already chosen for us. And then down here, we're going to have a from option. So we're going to go ahead and choose the account we want to go pull money from. This is typically going to be your external account. And if you don't have one so far attached to your Charles Schwab, we'll have a link in the show notes how to add an external account. So right over here, we're going to tap here. We're going to choose from the drop down menu. So we went ahead and chose our external account. And now we want to choose which account we're going to have this go into. Now we have multiple different accounts here on Charles Schwab, such as our individual brokerage or HSA, as well as just a regular bank account. And we want this to go into our investment account, of course. So once we go in here, we're going to choose that option from the drop down menu on our selected account. Now we went ahead and filled that out. So you can see it actually shows, shows you how much you actually have in that current account. Of course, it's not going to show you what you have in your external account, but no worries there. You should have an idea of what's in that account. Next up, we're going to go ahead and choose how much we want to transfer into this account, as well as the current frequency. Right now, it's currently set to one time, but you can go ahead and switch it to weekly, monthly, and whichever option works best for you. And then what day you want that transferred, it is going to have the day that you're doing this. But of course, you can go ahead and choose up into the future if you would like to. And then down here, it actually will tell you a little bit about the funds. If you're planning on trading on this with your brokerage account, you'll have access to be able to trade those funds right away, as well as how long it's going to take to actually pull that money from your bank account to be able to have it fully vested into your brokerage. All right. So I went ahead and added $15 here for us. And then we're going to go ahead and click on the continue button once we are ready. Now, this next section is for reviewing and submitting your transfer. So nothing has been official yet. So please keep that in mind as you're going through this, because we want to go through, make sure everything looks good. And then we can click our submit button to go to the very next page. And once you see right over here that your transfer request was submitted, you are officially having that money transfer into your account. And again, if it's available into your brokerage account, you should have that fund available immediately. So you can go ahead and start buying stocks on the Charles Schwab account. And no worries, we got you covered on how to do just that. So check out our video right over here on screen to learn how to buy your first stock on Charles Schwab.